Hey guys, here I am again, week number two. Woo! Uh, that's from Bebop, Bebop Place. I think that's how you pronounce it. It just opened up uh, in my area. It's kind of like a Chipotle's with an Asian spin on it. I, I really like it. It's not bad. I'm going to be going again. However, I was 471 last week, and this week I'm 474. Yes, I know. I just started the journey week one should have crushed it but that's part of what I want to do with this series is go week by week and evaluate what I did and then tr do them make the changes and have the next week be better plus I want accountability you know if I go missing it's like hey he started another week one and never finished you know, I'm not going to beat myself up too much. I'm just going to get back on that horse and ride. Uh, I figured out what I did. And what I did was I had the kids over and I wanted to make sure they had enough to eat. And I had enough to eat for my stuff. And I bought all my stuff, bought all their stuff. Well, they went home. I still had a ton of their stuff left. And I just can't have it in the house. As simple as that. I realize I cannot have it in the house and also I need to make the kids not make but I, I need to offer the kids better choices for them to eat too because you know I don't want them going down the same path as me I added back walking yes I'm going to the track and my new plan instead of just trying to get one lap a day is uh, when I go to go out driving because I drive for Uber and Lyft uh, I'll do a lap and before I get home do another lap and then uh, a lot of times I go out two times in a day then I could probably get three to four laps and uh, as soon as I can build it up I want to get more than that but I did realize that I did one lap and it, it was really rough on me because I am 475 however I got to get moving got to do something I'm still in uh physical therapy for my knees so there we go let's see what uh next week brings